What is going on guys? Welcome to another LSPDFR tutorial. Last tutorial I think we done how to install Simple Control. I think this time we're going to do how to install Simple HUD. Um, this to me, I really like this. I think it's a, a really cool uh, mod personally for LSPDFR. Um, you can add postals to your map and it redoes your mini map. You guys will see um, once you get it set up and stuff like that. It's really cool. Now you're going to need OpenIV for this and you're going to need a scripts folder. And what do I mean by scripts folder? You're going to, and I've done and got this installed. Um, you're going to need to make a scripts folder if you don't have one. So all you got to do is just make a new folder name it scripts just like this right here that's all you need uh, the next thing you're going to need is of course like i said is open iv i'm going to go ahead and launch this that way i could show you guys what you're going to have to have for this um, go ahead and turn on edit mode up here you're going to have package installers you have to let's do the add-ons first the postal map um, and so on and so forth you're also going to need these files here which I'll show you where they go here in a second uh, you're going to want to grab this install dot OIV and drag it to your desktop or you could take it like this and drag and drop it here like that and it will install that way as well um, the next thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to grab this now this goes into your scripts folder okay so uh, it's going to go in just like this here just like that that's all you have to do with that uh, the next thing we're going to do, let's do the props and texture. Uh, you're going to have two more. You've also got to uninstall in here. Don't use this unless you want to uninstall the, you know, the simple HUD stuff. Just go to the install. You're going to have two parts. Uh, you can drag and drop those in here like I showed you. Or you can drag these to, to your desktop and go to Tools and Package Installer and install it that way. It's however you want to do it. Once you do that, you can exit out Open IV. You're done with that. Uh, you're done with the... Let me go back here. You're done with the props and textures. Next thing you want is the Grand Theft Auto 5 folder. Now, I personally recommend the Nightly. That's what I use. That's what I suggest you guys use. Uh, so go ahead and click on the nightly scripts. Like I said, you'd have to have a scripts folder in your main directory of your Grand Theft Auto 5. So go ahead and make a folder. And you're going to want to take all of these files and drag and drop right into here. That's all you're going to want to do. You're going to want to drag and drop in here. Let's go back here. Um, if you guys want to, you guys can read all of this. That's totally up to you guys. But you're going to need... I forgot about this too. You're going to need uh, uh, something else as well. So... These you're gonna need, which it's when you go to um, to go download this mod, I will link it for you guys. It will on lcpdfr.com. The guy will actually link this stuff. If you have any problems with this, you can join the Discord. I'll make sure we fix you up. Okay, so you're gonna to want to drag all these files. You don't necessarily need this one, but you're gonna to want to drag all of these files here. So we're going to do these two files here. And you're going to want to do these two files here. And drag and drop those in there just like that. And you're going to want to take these files here. I haven't installed these yet. Like I should have. You're going to want to take these files here. Right here. And drag and drop these into your main directory. Then you can just refresh. Scroll down. And you will see the script hooks in here. After that, you can start up your Grand Theft Auto 5 and you should be good to go. If you have problems, please join the Discord. I will link it below. I will be more than happy to help you. I have no problem with that, okay? Uh, I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate, man, you all have been going crazy with the subs, the likes, and everything. Make sure you all continue to do that. And I will also uh, link my Twitch down below. I'm live on YouTube and you know Twitch both when I do go live. But if you want to come over and check me out on uh, Twitch as well, please, you're more than welcome to come over there as well. We'd love to have you over there. Like I said, if you guys have any questions, problems, anything like that with GTA 4, GTA 5, join the Discord. Somebody will get up with you. And I appreciate you guys watching. And I hope that you guys have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day and or night or evening. And we will catch you guys in the next one. Good night, guys.